it's a great event. Um, first, I was very impressed by the size and the quality of participation. Um, my expectations, of course, are lively engagements, a rich, rich exchange of ideas, um, opportunities to network with both existing and potential clients. And um, one day down the line, I would say those, those um, expectations are being met. African CEOs need to keep abreast of developments across the region. Um, they need to network with um, potential clients. They need to share ideas. Um, disruption is happening everywhere. I think um, it is very important for us to um, exchange views and understand what will likely be the face of tomorrow's business and be prepared today. One of the areas where I would need our business models to change is in the area of initiatives that will aid financial inclusion. Um, I still think the level of financial inclusion across our markets is ridiculously low. So embracing technology that will enable financial institutions reach the um, currently um, excluded um, demographics, um, including women, including the younger generations, including those who are in the rural areas. So uh, models that we can explore that would um, achieve that will be one of the great um, changes that need to happen in this market. Definitely, as a woman, it's harder to get to the top than a man. I always say you have to work probably thrice as hard as the men to get the same opportunities the men get. Um, they are on, unspoken um, negative mindsets mm -hmm. about women in leadership that you have to overcome. So essentially, some of the difficulties are simply being overlooked for positions and um, assumptions that, you know, this position is meant for a man, especially in a male-dominated industry like the world of finance. So those are some of the challenges I've had to overcome. Key trends that will shape business, land and, um, business landscape would include innovation, technological disruption that is taking place already, um, the digital um, economy has come to stay. And we need to keep abreast of it. We need to ensure that we're channeling our businesses in ways that can maximize the potentials of the digital economy and especially connect with the next generation of consumers.